What is up everybody? Thanks for watching another video. If you like my videos, make sure you like, subscribe, and check out my channel for more. And in this video, we're going to cover Elvis Presley Boulevard that is on the south side of Memphis. No, not the south side of Memphis. To check out that video, go ahead and follow the link in the description below. In this video, Elvis Presley Boulevard passes by Graceland, which is the popular tourist destination to see everything Elvis Presley. It's basically an Elvis Presley museum. Nonetheless, in this video, I do cover the roadway in its entirety. As you can see, we basically start things off at the Mississippi and Tennessee state line. Even though we are technically in the city limits of Memphis, it looks and feels more like suburbia down here. This is the 38116 zip code that we are in, where 41,000 people call home, about 10,000 less people from the 2000 year census. About 17% of people 25 and older here have a bachelor's degree, an estimated 10% are unemployed, and it may look decent in these parts, but the numbers state that there is definitely an economic struggle. The average household income is $42,000 a year. Looks like the only thing missing from this commercial strip is a plasma donation center. Well, here it is, Graceland, the mansion once owned by Elvis Presley. It is the second most visited house in the U.S. after the White House, with 650,000 visitors a year. The mansion is on the right side of the road, with other museum-like places surrounding the area.
Well, 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 what do you know? As it always goes, once you cross a freeway or railroad tracks, or in this case both, you always seem to either enter or exit a ghetto. Want to guess whether we're entering or exiting a ghetto? Casey's Motel, eh? That's not the only sketch motel scene on this stretch, as there are a few more ahead and a few more that we've already passed. How about this? If you don't think that this is a sketch area, I'll give you $100 to park your car in that parking lot and sleep there on a summer night. Just kidding, don't do that. I had to say just kidding because some winner watching this probably would have done that and demanded his $100. Regardless, this isn't somewhere that I would want to be if my car broke down. Well guys, that's the end of this one. If you enjoy my videos, make sure you like, subscribe, and check out my channel for more. We'll see you next time. Peace!